So what is lipoprotein little a or LP little a? <clears throat> First of all, if you're going to search it, you need to know a little bit about how to spell it because it's not quite what it sounds. You, to search it, you can go lipoprotein, L-I-P-O-P-R-O-T-E-I-N, begin paren, small a, end paren. Or you can just do L-P, begin paren, small a, end paren. Now, if you don't remember what a lipoprotein is, <clears throat> basically it's just a protein made by the body. So it can transport fats, oils, and waxy substances. It takes the large fat bubbles and turns them into microscopic ones so they don't clog the arteries. I have another video on that, lipoproteins, in, uh, in this channel. LP little a was discovered in 1963 and we've had tests available for it for years. What's puzzling and tragic is that very few people get tested for LP little a. It's even more puzzling and tragic because there is effective treatment for LP little a. <clears throat> now the concentration that we as humans have can vary from less than 0.2 to over 200, and I'm not going to give you the limit, uh, the units, it would just confuse you, or conf it confuses me. Um, <clears throat> that concentration is genetically determined. Now, how do you find out your concentration? You ask your doctor, or you can see our website, we provide these services as well. Now, what is the treatment for LP little a? Niacin. <clears throat> And uh, you can also see a video from us on how to take niacin. Now, some preventionists argue that niacin doesn't work. I disagree. I actually have LP little a, and I take niacin, two grams a day. I'm also taking it for my low HDL. And again, that's yet another video. Uh, Linus Pauling, many of you remember him. He said that vitamin C plus a couple of other things would help decrease LP little a. Other preventionists would argue that you just need to focus on other risks like LDL. I partially agree. I would clearly say focus on other risks. I'm not quite so concerned about LDL though. <clears throat>